What is up? This is your LA in a Minute, and today's episode is pretty awesome. We're going to talk about the top 10 oldest fast food chains that originate in Los Angeles. Let's get into it. Founded in 1948 by Harry and Esther Snyder in Baldwin Park, Harry saw car culture developing and knew people would want to eat on the open road. So he tinkered in his garage, came up with the first two-way speaker, and the drive through was born, and so was In-N-Out Burger. Number nine, in Exposition Park in 1947, Lovey Yancey opened a three-stool hamburger stand called Mr. Fat Burger. This was huge because an African-American woman owning her own business in the 40s in a racially charged United States made Yancey a true pioneer. And by the way, in 1952, the Mr. was dropped and it became Fat Burger. Number eight, originally founded in 1946 in North Hollywood as Walsh's Hot Dogs by Richard and Bernice Walsh, who sold chili dogs and tamales. Shortly thereafter, the chain name changed to Cupid's, which was Bernice's nickname. Number seven, also in 1946, Dave Barham opened a stand on Santa Monica Beach that served fresh squeezed lemonade and ice cream cones called Party Puffs. Realizing that menu might be a little limited, Barham used his mom's cornbread recipe, made corn dogs, put them on a stick, changed the name of his stand to Hot Dog on a Stick, and a beachside and food court legend was born. Number six, also in 1946, Tommy Kulax bought a spot on Beverly and Rampart for $800 and built an 8x15 stand with only enough room inside for the cooks. He had enough room for chili though, and that's the secret sauce that spawned hundreds of imitators in Los Angeles and made Tommy's the original. Number five, again in 1946, George Foster bought the rights to Dairy Queen in California, but the state wouldn't let him use the word dairy in the name because the product did not have a high enough percentage of butter fat. Instead, he changed the name to Foster's Old Fashioned Freeze, opened up in Inglewood, and a milkshake legend was born. Number four, in 1941, Carl Karcher and his wife Margaret purchased a hot dog cart on the corner of Florence and Central in Los Angeles. They soon had four hot dog carts, but they soon opened their first full-service restaurant, Carl's Drive-In Barbecue, in Anaheim in 1946 and eventually became Carl's Jr. Number three, in 1937, Patrick McDonald opened the Airdrome, a food stand which sold hamburgers for 10 cents. His sons Maurice and Richard moved the entire building to San Bernardino, where they renamed it McDonald's Barbecue and eventually McDonald's. Number two, in 1939, Paul and Betty Pink opened a push cart selling hot dogs and tamales on the corner of La Brea and Melrose. 1946, they built their own building and Pink's Hot Dogs has been an L.A. institution ever since. And number one, with $300, Bob Weehan opened up Bob's Pantry in Glendale in 1936. So Bob's pioneered the use of car hops, which makes it the oldest fast food restaurant that originated in Los Angeles. All right, L.A., it's been a minute.